Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. So for today's video is going to be a tutorial on this pink inspired Valentine's Day look. Um, I know usually people like to go for red and bold colours but I've been loving this look lately. So I thought yeah why not share that with you. So that's what this tutorial is going to be. The palette that I use is the Urban Decay Naked Heat palette and this is like my only palette that I have and I love all the colours in there. It's great for a beginner like me and the shadows are quite easy to blend, they're very soft. And so yeah, like I said, this is the look I've been wearing lately and I am completely obsessed with it. Probably that's because this is the only um, look that I've been doing and I've sort of like worn it so many times that I think I've managed to perfect it. So I thought um, I don't think I'm going to do anything else, anything different for Valentine's Day. So I thought, yeah, why not share that with you? So that's what this tutorial is going to be. So if you'd like to see how I achieved this look, then stay tuned and I'll see you at the end of the video. Okay guys, so I've already done my base. Um, this tutorial um, is more on the eye, so I've sort of done my base off camera. So um, I've applied foundation, done my under eye concealer, eyebrows, contoured, and just put a bit of lip balm on so I don't come to you with crusty lips. So that's what I've done so far. So next uh, um, I'm just gonna shoot straight into the eye tutorial. So first off, I'm going to use the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. On my eyelids so this will help um, with the eyeshadow having something to stick to it and also help with the pigment of the colors as well so just gonna apply it. then I'm going to use my finger just to blend it in for the eyes I'm going to use um, the Urban Decay heat palette for the eye tutorial these four along the line here that's what I'm going to use for today's eye tutorial and um, color I'm going to use is cayenne Next up is Scorched, which is the glittery, the um, metallic rose gold shade. To intensify the shade, you can always add your fixing spray to it, um, just to bring out some more pigment. I'm going to use Cayenne again on my lower lash line, just to join up this um, bit here together. Right, so, to sort of intensify this a little bit and bring in some more depth i'm going to go in with the darker shade which is ashes as an eyeliner and create an outer v just on the outside of my eye so i'm going to go back into scorch just for the inner eye socket and um, just to brighten up this look here to make the shimmer on my eyelid pop a little bit more i'm going to use the fenty beauty um killer what highlighter i'm going to use the which one is this one moscow mule just to bring up that color a little bit i don't have my fix plus with me so I'm just going to have to improvise, but this. I'm going to go in with Enfuego just to darken up my lower lash line a little bit. Brow bone, I'm going to use, a, is it Chaser or Ounce? I'm going to use Ounce for the brow bone just to highlight that a little bit. The mascara, I'm using this shampoo, uh, shampoo. <laughs> this sample from Chanel, the Le Volume um, mascara. I like how this opens up my eyes. I don't wear false lashes, but if you do, this will be the moment. Go for it, but I don't wear false lashes, so I like to use a lengthening mascara that will just sort of like open up my eyes and separate my lashes. And this one, okay, okay, well, that's done. Close up, I can see some patchiness of the eyeshadow, so I'm gonna go back in with a clean brush, I've just cleaned it. I'm gonna give this a quick clean and um, I'll just go back in and sort of blend out any patches. Which I'm... That's the eyes done, I'm gonna do the cheeks now. Okay, so for blusher, I'm going to use the Bare Minerals um, Gen Nude Blusher. I've featured this on here before and I'm still loving this color. So I'm gonna use that on the cheek. Lightly dust this all over my cheek. Highlighter, you guessed it, is going to be the Fenty Beauty um, Killer Watch. So I'm going to go for, I'm not great with highlighters, I'm going to start off with a subtle one which is the Ginger Binge and then I'll top up with Moscow Mood just to bring up some more intensity. So using a contour brush, just going to lightly dust this here and place this just right here.
and put a little bit on my raw bone as well. Don't forget the tip and then here. Basically we're just going pink all over everywhere. Spot here is just blocking my blessings. Right, I'm just gonna go light handed with this one here. I don't want it to look too much, so it's a little bit. Right, stop. Okay, here we go. I think I'm looking a bit too pink in this area here, so I'm gonna just tone it down with some translucent powder. Just to blend this in a little bit. Okay, so we're gonna move on to the lips, and I've got three lip products here to show you. I've got a classic red lipstick from Bare Minerals and this is in the shade Hustler. I haven't worn this yet, but it looks like this. So I'm gonna try this on, but since this is a pink inspired look, I'm gonna go for my Lancome um, Lapsulu Rouge in the shade 253, um, Brune Evasion, which is like this. So it's got like a, it's like a dusty rose pink brown mauve um, shade and then for a bit of gloss I'm gonna add the Fenty Beauty gloss bomb on top I've been loving that combo but I'm gonna show you the lipstick on its own with this look and then I'm gonna top it up top it off with the lip gloss take it off put on the red lipstick just here's the lipstick on its own um... okay so I'm now going to top it up Top it off with the lip gloss just so you can see. So here's the look with the lip gloss on top of the lipstick. Right. Okay, so we're going to remove this off and try on the red lipstick. I'm going to light my lips first with MAC uh, Lip Liner in the shade Brick. God for lip liners because my lip, my my cupid spot is practically non-existent. But there you go. Uh, I just created one. I am loving this lip color. I hope the camera is picking up, but it's got this metallic sheen to it. It's not glittery, but it's just got that shine. Wow. This is so moisturizing. So this is it for the red color so i'm gonna do a uh, screen i'm gonna put on the screen the three types of lip combos and then you can tell me which one you prefer or you like let's take this off and put on my favorite lip combo but before i do i want you to comment down below which one do you prefer or which one would you wear um for this look okay did you guess this was my favorite let me know okay so now i'm back with my favorite lip combo which is the lipstick and that lip gloss together i just like this is very chic for daytime look. So let me know what you think of this look, guys. I will say, I should have said, I should have told you this before, that I am not a pro. So if you think I did a shoddy job, that's why. Um, but I hope you will be inspired. This will inspire you and you can do a better job than I did. But um, it was just to show you what colours um, I use or what colours I've been loving from this Urban Decay palette. And also just to give you in, in some ideas for this coming Valentine's Day. So yeah, so I want, so that's it. Let me know what you think. Um, is there anything that you would change? No, yes. Let me know in the comments box below and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Happy Valentine's Day.